Hi all, this is Master Muncher and welcome to another 1v1 Unifieds Battle episode to the channel. In this matchup we're fighting with our Demi Lancers, the first time they appear in this series. Since our Portuguese Knights have been cutting all other melee cavalry like butter, let's try out our other melee cavalry unit art. We only have two, the Demi Lancers and the Portuguese Knights, the Encobertados or Encobertos, as one of you already pointed out, that's how you pronounce it in Portuguese and that's how you write it. But there you have it, the Demi Lancers they by no means are a weak unit they are the weakest unit from the or melee cavalry but they're not weak at all they're very well rounded as you probably would expect even though in our campaign they did take a beating but they were very tired and we dismounted it and, and charged it against walls so not really how they should be uh used <laughs> but there you have it 80 soldiers 12 morale 30 melee attack 4 melee defense 40 charge bonus 15 bonus for scavery and 10 armor now very well rounded unit with good stamina. The Demi Lancers don't have, they're not fully plated and not like the Portuguese Knights because during the 16th century and the 17th century, 1500s, 1600s, the military revolution was around. The role of cavalry changed in warfare in Europe, especially. And with gunpowder units, spikes, the, the classic heavy hitting, fully plated uh, like Portuguese, or not Portuguese, or just Knights with huge lances kind of became somewhat obsolete but they still needed shock cavalry in a quicker f fashion, and but they can still get it, deliver the punch, and this is where the Diamond Lancers came in. And there you have it, all here with the officer, and today we are fighting the Takeda clan, the superior horse clan, the superior cavalry clan of Shogun 2 Total War, and we're fighting against the Takeda Fire Key. 80 soldiers, 25 morale, 15 melee attack, 2 melee defense, 45 charge bonus, 15 bonus for scavenger and 4 armor with good stamina. These are Yari Samurai mounted, so they will proper, will give us a proper fight. We will not be using diamond formation since one of your writers pointed out they, they're better for uh, infantry engagements. And in our own light tests, they haven't done that much for us. So there you have it. Let's start this, char this, this battle and see which unit really wins. Or Demi Lancers or the Yari, Takeda Yari Ki. Okay, please charge forward. Yes! Uh, they, why did they like deviate in the last possible moment? And if uh, if they're in defensive, they don't charge. There you go. They're breaking. Oh man. There you go. The Demi Lancers seem to be the superior one out of the Takeda Fire Key. But they, they killed 10 of us, eh, that was a, a bit of a unclimatic fight, isn't it? But there you have it, let's um, up fully upgrade the Takeda Fire Key and see how it goes. See you guys in a little bit. Hi yo, welcome to the second fight, this time the Takeda Fire Key are fully upgraded. 33 morale now, 90 melee attack, 10 melee defense, 2 with 45 charge bonus, 15 bonus for scavery and 4 armor against our Demi Lancers. Now, they are in the attacking stance, so let's hopefully they won't just charge away at the last minute again. But it's just, if we just put them in defensive one, they don't charge at all. So they lose the charge bonus. And I'm still uncertain which one is better in these instances. So let's just wait for them to get really close and then we we'll charge with our Demi Lancers. Still unupgraded. Hopefully they won't deviate. Okay, why do they do this? So weird. Or at least now they're fighting. Fully upgraded, they probably should give a fight. Do they constantly try to like charge? That's why it's what's happening. I think so. Whoa! But they are breaking it. Wow! Even doing that stupid thing that they're doing, they're kind of... Oh, not really. They almost... Whoa! They actually won? Alright. How? We lost. Okay, this was very weird, very hectic. But there you have it. The Takeda Fire Key... No, Fire Key, the Takeda uh, Yari Key. Now I forget the name, sorry. They they did win the second engagement. 
and our demi lances were routed, so we'll have a final third one with them on the defensive this time, so they won't get the charge bonus, and we'll see how it goes. See you guys in a little bit. Hi, all, welcome to the third and final fight. The demi lances won the first one. The the Yari Ki actually won the second one surprisingly, almost not. So this one kind of. Let's see how it goes. I actually am very uncertain who will come out on top. Now the Nemilenses have been fully upgraded as the Yari Ki. Uh, 20 morale, 17 melee attack, 12 melee defense, still with 4 charge bonus, 15 bonus for scavery, and 10 armor. Against the Takeda Fire Ki. 33 morale, 19 melee attack, 10 melee defense, 45 charge bonus, 15 bonus for scavery, and 4 armor. So please, uh, if you guys have tips, I know one of you already told me that it's better to leave them defensive and maybe wait for them to give the charge and then charge them. But like, give me if you have tips and ideas on how to like do these uh, mat cavalry matchups a bit better, because the AI seems to just like charges and then at the last minute uh, deviate and then they want to um, they just want want to like keep charging so they don't sustain stay in sustained combat. So let's see how it goes. But there you have it, fully upgraded fire key. Very cool unit. Look at this. Let's see if they charge us. If we walk in towards them. No, they still don't. Yep, they just take the charge. Like idiots. They lose 20 soldiers. Let's see if in sustained combat they'll actually do anything. Because if this isn't back up, okay, this is actually looking a bit better. But now they're running. Yeah, cavalry is a bit weird. They did kill more of us though, but they are breaking. Alright. There you have it, the Demon Lancers won. Whoa, they lost a lot of soldiers actually, so maybe this is the way to go. Even if they don't get their bonus, this is cavalry or the charge bonus. But there you have it, they killed almost half of us. That's actually quite a lot. So the Demi Lancers have proven to be superior to the Yari Ki. Uh, maybe if the AI was a bit better, it would be a closer matchup. But I, so far, with the tests we're doing with the series, the, Yari, the Demi Lancers have it. So there you go, guys. Thank you very much for watching this 1v1 episode. Please leave your tips and comments and suggestions to improve or, or change some things in the cavalry engagements. But thank you very much for watching. Hope you all enjoyed and see you guys next time.